guys and welcome back to my channel. Today we are talking about my top five beauty products and in today's video we're talking about Hourglass Cosmetics. So if you guys want to see what my top five picks are for Hourglass then keep on watching. But first if you're new here, hi my name is Joy. I do beauty, fashion, and lifestyle related videos. So if you're not already subscribed to my channel, please subscribe and don't forget to hit the little notification bell so you are notified every time I upload a video. Alright guys, so the first product that belongs in my top five for Hourglass is definitely my Veil Mineral Primer. I talk about this product time and time again only because it is pretty darn amazing. So if you haven't tried it, definitely go out and try it. This product just really helps to prolong your makeup. It's definitely a primer that goes before foundation. So not only is it a primer before foundation, but it also helps with pores, redness, fine lines, wrinkles, and it also has an SPF 15, so it's also protecting your skin from the sun. It's not a high dosage of SPF, but for the most part, it's protecting it and it's adding a little bit more protection. Um, this right here is actually the travel size. Um, I believe there is definitely a much larger bottle and I will definitely repurchase it in the larger bottle. Cost wise, this one here is $19 and the larger size is $54. But you guys, definitely I'm obsessed with this product. It's something that I cannot apply my makeup without. So it's become a part of my makeup routine. And most of you guys know that I'm not much of a primer person. I've used tons of primers in the past and haven't really stuck to them, um, except for this one. I am completely obsessed. So that's the reason why it belongs in my top five for Hourglass. So definitely give this a try. Alright guys, so the next product that belongs in my top 5 for Hourglass is my Vanish Seamless Finish Foundation Stick, this bad boy right here. Anyways, this foundation stick, you guys, I have been literally wearing for the past month or so. Um, I do have a full product review on this foundation, so I'm not really going to talk a lot about it, so I'll link that video in the cards. You guys can definitely check that out. But to make a long story short, this is a long wearing foundation stick. Um, I believe it's up to 12 hours. So this is pretty much what it looks like. So you twist it up. It glides on. It's amazing. It is full coverage as it states. But to me, I think it's definitely more medium coverage and you can build it up to full coverage. You can use it as a concealer. You can use it to kind of dot around and conceal any imperfections or you can simply wear it as a foundation. This is actually what I have on today and that's all I have on today um, along with powder but it's just amazing and I love it. So if you're looking for something that's more portable, um, easy, full coverage, no fuss kind of foundation stick, I definitely highly suggest that you check this one out. I love it. There's no scent. It's not irritating at all, didn't break me out. I mean, it's awesome. All right guys, so the next product on my top five for Hourglass is in fact the Ambient Lighting Powder. And I have this one in the color Radiant Light. So basically, this is what it looks like. I have used this time and time again. I've talked about this powder time and time again, and I absolutely love it. It's definitely a soft blend kind of powder. It's supposed to kind of give you a natural glow. So if your skin is lacking um, radiance, say your skin is more on the dry side and you don't really have that natural glow to your skin, this is something that you can kind of dust on top of your foundation or on top of a regular um, powder to just give that glow um, that your skin is probably lacking. And I wouldn't use this to set your makeup. Um, I would just use it as a finishing kind of a powder. I would still probably use a regular powder to set your makeup, especially if you're more on the oily side. If you're dry, you could probably get away with just using this, but if you're more on the oily side, I probably would use a regular powder and then this on top. Alright guys, so the next product on my top five for Hourglass is my Arch Brow Sculpting Pencil. So this retractable brow pencil is amazing. It's super, super quick. It goes on like 
glides on effortlessly and it's super pigmented. You don't need to like really, really press on the product. So it definitely twists up. You, it's, when you first get it, it's like really shaped kind of angular and really, really sharp. Obviously I've been using it for quite some time so it's got a little bit more of a round tip, but it's still pretty, pretty defined. Um, so especially if you're more, um, if you have more thicker brows or you like more of a thicker look, this pencil would be the best pencil for you. But for the most part, I absolutely love this brow pencil. There's not much I can say about it. I do have a updated brow routine. Um, so I'll link that on the card so that way you guys can definitely check that out. One thing too is that this pencil does have a spoolie. So it's a soft spoolie. It's kind of a thicker um, spoolie there, but it just helps to kind of comb out your brows and you can really um, shape them or not shape them, but like place them where you want them. And for price wise, this does cost $34. I think that it's definitely worth $34 because it does last and there's a lot of product in here. So I just love this brow pencil. I've definitely tried this out. If you guys are looking for a brow pencil that's more in a pencil um, retractable form, um, definitely check this one out. All right guys, so the last product on my top five for Hourglass are their lipsticks. Now these are also known as the Confession Ultra Slim High Intensity Refillable Lipsticks. And basically they look like this. They look pretty, pretty darn amazing. The packaging is super sleek in this like kind of bullet spike looking um, uh, pencil. So basically I bought this in a set. I don't know if this set is still available, you guys. I apologize for placing this in my top five when in fact it might not be available as a set. It is available individually, so you can still get the lipstick. Um, so if I can find the set, I'll definitely link it below. Definitely check out the info bar. Um, hopefully it's still available. So I'm gonna go ahead and swatch them for you. The first color is called My One Desire, and basically you just twist it up like a normal lipstick. And I'm just gonna swatch this right here. So that's what it looks like. It's definitely more on the pinky mauve side. And I mean, again, the packaging, you guys, is super, super amazing. I love it. The second color that comes in the kit is You Are My. And this is my absolute favorite. I wear this color almost all the time, especially if I want something just a little bit darker and more defined. Love that shade. And the last color in the kit is called True Love Means. And this is more on the, um, kind of like a pinky, um, like kind of like a light pink to like almost like a light creamsicle color. I don't know. It has hints of like orange. I don't know. I don't know. It's hard for me to describe that color, but it's like a light, kind of like a lighter shade. Um, so yeah, those are the swatches right there. Again, they're super pigmented. They glide on. They last pretty much all day. I mean, obviously if you're gonna eat or drink, some of it will come off so you do have to touch up. I mean, all the colors they definitely can wear so that's the reason why I opted to getting the set. But yeah, I absolutely love the lipsticks. They're amazing and they're definitely approved by me. So definitely check them out if you haven't already. So that is it for me today. I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye. Like a tug of war, what's a dog for? Do I want it, babe? I still got a little flame for ya uh, Even though you drove me mad